Hello to you guys. This is for Aries. Oh, and this is about putting into action whatever your plan is. It's about older, wanting to come into action. That's what Aries means now. You know it. And they're Mars, and that's that far energy, that fire down below. There's a fire down below in Aries' soul. There's a fire down below. Oh, this is about you having dangerous pleasures, Aries. If you're new to my channel, please like Please hit like, subscribe, and share right now because um, I need to get around and I do something different. It's called Puzzle Time, Egyptian Puzzle Time, and I thought of it, Pamela did. And nobody has my permission to copy because I wrote the story from the book and I used the letters in Puzzle Time. And, and I know that I'm going to get around and I love y'all. And thank you, new subscriber, this morning I saw and I love you. And anybody that hits uh, subscribe, you'll be blessed for it because you'll just you're just helping me. And I thank you, and I'm grateful for you. So here's a story. If you know an Aries, if you're inquiring on an Aries, or if you're an Aries, or just whatever you're coming here for, you'll find out something today. So hit hit like and hit subscribe. 111. Oh, they might have a new beginning. Aries might, but I don't know. But it says dangerous pleasure. The secret of reaping the greatest fruitfulness and the greatest enjoyment from life is to live dangerously. And that's by Frederick. Nuts. I don't know. Um, I used to live dangerously. Um, yeah, I, I did do drugs and stuff. Uh, I, I I took pleasure in doing it all the time, and I don't anymore. And I'm not gonna lie. Sometimes I smoke marijuana. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. But I don't do it with these readings, cause when you do, it just sounds crazy things. But anyway, it's telling you to take a stand and follow your energy. And on Thursday, so. Thursday, and there's a four and a five up there. See, there's a five and a four, so it could be in four or five days, or this Thursday, or it could be in nine days if you add that Saturn truth, but it looks like a four. <laughs> See what I'm saying? But anyway, you know what I'm talking about. So it's telling you to act all your energy, but remember. It said the secret of reaping the greatest fruitfulness and the greatest enjoyment from life is to live dangerously. So this Aries lives dangerously. They got a prostitute uh, energy attached to them and they are placing material consideration and security above their self-empowerment. That's what they're doing, okay? That's why it's saying you're living dangerously, Aries. You can't be committed if you put money over everything. If you put money over a commitment, God won't let you have that commitment, don't you understand? You can't place money over a commitment. And if you've if you've if you've messed with somebody else's money and their security and their way of living and their commitment, you're gonna get in trouble. I hate to tell you. And I saw you all know people. I'm not talking to y'all, I'm talking about people that I actually know. I do know of Aries and, and yeah, uh huh, I do. But you know, commitment is an important factor to achieve a successful relationship. You can't be a, you can't be committed if you're paying for prostitutes, okay, Aries men, Aries women. I don't know what woman buys sex. I've never heard of that, but I guess there's some out there. But this is about the tall whites, and this this person is very uncertain to you, and they they distrust you, and that's why they got their guard up. You might yeah you, you you might be uh, was uh, wonder why they blocked you and it worried you. Don't worry, cause they're 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 the one not trustworthy okay that's what it means all right and this is about uh someone is wanting to give you some uh some flowers and maybe you know somebody is a aries on the ninth and the tenth is their birthday i don't know but this is a journey this is a journey that you're on and this journey that you're on is it, you're uncertain about it. That's why you don't trust it. And the Spirit Keeper of the West is helping you look. Ain't that funny how Spirit shoots them out? Spirit Keeper of the West and then a horse spirit come out. Freedom is yours. That's where horses run wild. See? I'm true. And I, I flipped all these cards out from all them different decks for you all. Okay? And if you like what I do, hit subscribe and hit like. I love you. Know, you can always come back here at Pound Star Oracle and get a message. And this is my idea, and it's angel gifts, and nobody has my permission, and your angels gave you the gift of visions. You can see things that are going to happen before they ever happen, and your guides will show you what to do to show others in pain. Oh, they always show me. They took me out, and they t 
took me out and made me sit down and do a practice for you all. And that's why I need to help getting around 505. I love y'all. Please change and help me. I'm I'm not doing anything wrong. I sit here and tend to my own business. Nobody bothers me. My children, they gone. Uh, and uh, one of them has a child and the other one don't. But they both got their own houses now. And I love my boys. And I'm proud of them. And I love y'all if you're watching. Uh, but they do things on their own, and, and this is something I'm wanting to do for my family, my legacy. This is this is, this is is what I'm doing, okay, Aries? I, and maybe you're doing something like me, but it said you felt the damn energy when you was in another state. And maybe someone had done some bad shit in your home, and maybe with your dude. Oh, did you hear that? And with your dude. Oh, so if your dude is Aries or Aries, if you're a woman and... Somebody might have did something with your dude if you had to leave and go to a different state. Maybe you felt that. And I put this on a card because I did feel something weird. Not about with my dude. Somebody did something with my dude. I just felt weird like when I come back home, it was like something wasn't right. Do you know what I'm saying? But it says when you have to figure out on your own what is real and what ain't real, then of course you could act like wishy-washy up and down and out of sorts. And this may be a karmic lesson that needed learned. So I always, or... If you're an acquiring on Aries, they needed to learn a lesson. That was a karmic. That's a karmic, whoever you're attached to. And it could be your marriage partner sits at commitments up there. And you know that uh, they're. it's not self-empowerment when you place money over anything because this is a vamp. And some people only want you for your high energy cause they have to feed to survive. Maybe you was giving this Aries a lot of energy and and now you don't. And, oh, they're feeling the pain of it now because they don't have your good high energy. That's all it means. All right. And these are my cards that I did. I got like 500 of them, you all. It says a bunch of different things. So go ahead and subscribe because I'm going to tell you something good. Now, look. Now, whoever this Aries is or whoever you're on acquiring on, if they're an Aries or if you're an Aries, somebody can't stop thinking of you, honey. And, uh, oh, and you might be a fortune teller. Oh, and this is, you know, you're going to have a luck and an advantage. This is a blessing from the vine. Yes, this is a blessing from the vine that I found Puzzle Time, Egyptian Puzzle Time, my idea. And I wrote the story on it from the book. And that's my idea. And I love you and I claim it. And nobody's going to steal it. Oh, and Fun Cereal, they can't stop thinking about you. This is about, um, what's that say? Hang on, you all. This is saying you're sweet and delightful and you're generous. Oh, if y'all think I'm sweet and delightful and generous, would you please hit subscribe. I love you. Oh, and I need the help. And I appreciate your help. You more than you'll know. But you're growing. Oh, you're growing at the moment. And some this something about reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. Okay? Someone from your past is returning to your life. And it could be an Aries or if you're if you're an Aries watching this, somebody from the past is coming to tell you something and let's do this Egyptian puzzle time and see what else it tells us but this could be a dangerous pleasure that you once and you know it was and spirit can you spell us out a name that these Aries that listen to me need to know a name or something you're trying to spell it it says a N and a B this is about your creative element and and somebody might be trying to persuade you, so don't let them. This is about your domesticity and enterprises that bring struggles, but with satisfactory outcomes. That's all it means. Oh, and then this is an act of affection, friendship. This is L. So we got N B L. Maybe you're noble. Is it an O spirit? I love you. Oh, and then we got grief. Uh, and this is G, and this is about, you know, you being in grief, maybe. There was alarms going off, but this is about melancholy and sadness, you know, nostalgia. And two nostalgia cards came out. But this is some unexpected event is getting ready to happen. And it could be with a friend of yours or with your partner because domesticity, you know. This thought of domesticity with this friend of yours and, and it's bringing about grief, that's all it means. And then we got Q. This is rendering court for the highest. And this is about devotion and fervor loving passion can we have some vowel spirit we have some vowel spirit and we got a v and an f and this is about maybe you felt abandonment and you're going through changes and 
It could be domestic discord and absences, something that is acquired and much that is lost. So you felt like you lost a lot of things, and it, it, I mean, anybody come to Turo, you do, you know, and you've lost a lot of things, and it's not the way it used to see, be, you know, but, and this could be about voluntary or unavoidable retirement from social life, yeah, because you had to go in solitude, maybe because people was fucking with everything you did, and I can't spell nothing yet, y'all, but as soon as I can, I will, I need some vows, spirit vows, vows to show these people, thank you, spirit, but em, so we have an E and an A and an O and an I and an E and an A and an O and an I. Can we have an E and an A and an O and an I? Can we, can we, spirit, can you repeat these? Give us an A and an E and O. There's an A, A, A. Somebody might drive a Ram. A Ram. Oh, ain't that funny? Ram, Ram. And there's an R. A raw, raw, raw. And I'm not done, you guys. I need an E and an I and an O. We have an E and an I and O spirit. E and an I and O. A e and an I and O. Oh, oh, oh. Can we have an E and an I and O? I put it back if it's something. So they got a lot of elves out here. Hang on a minute. Two elves already. Two elves. Maybe you got double. Maybe your letters in your name is double. Can we have a, a vial spirit a, E and an I and an O, please? E and an I and an O. They give you a Y. Can we have an E and an I and an O. And if I can't find them, I'm going to have to find them, you all, because I can't keep spitting out a bunch of letters and they're not. <coughs> Can we have an E? Can we have an E and an I? E and an I, E and an I, E and an I, E and an I. Here's an I. It give us one. I got D I. Somebody might be digging up dirt on you. D I. And what now? G. Dig. I see dig. I'll show it to y'all in a minute. This is unveiling the head, and this is about your individual evolution and you getting out of grief. That's all it means. And another Y. We have an E. Spirit might give us one just in. E, he did. I love you, Spirit. 1233. I love Spirit. If you do, hit subscribe. The Spirit loves me. Oh, yeah, they do. And there's an S, and that's all I'm going to get, y'all. Now, look, here's what I do. Because I'm not going to lie to you all. See, I needed this O, and it was right there in my hand. So I'm going to take it, all right? If I need this O in a minute, I'm going to have it, all right? And I'm going to put these over here so y'all see. Can you see? And here's an O. So I'm going to go ahead and throw it out. So let's see what we can spell for you guys today. Harry, something that's pertaining to you in your life. A good up a diddy and a what he got. Tip or dee top or dee dee. Maybe y'all know somebody whose name is. Oh, F A. Maybe you got a fan out there. I spelled fan out in my one of my readings the other day. It was just Egyptian time. Elf. See that little elf? See that little A? See that little N? And this is about your thoughts, your zeal, and the heartening concentration. You're very reserved at the moment. And then I found dig up here. See the D? See the I? G. They're digging up shit on you. That's what your fans are doing. They can't figure you out. Hello, fans. There's nothing to dig. I'll tell you my life. Just real easy on my channel. Don't you worry, because that's what I do. A doodle pa dee da dee da dee. A doodle da da da. A dee da da dee. Oh. 
I can spell something, you all, and you're going to be surprised how I spell it, okay? Hang on, you guys. Hang on. This is somebody in your family. One will fail. I've got to get it in a minute, but not right now. Two of them fail. Hang on. So I've got to put this right here, like right? fan. And I gotta put this, this uh, dig right here because I'm gonna put something in between it. I'm gonna put elm right here in between these. And then it's gonna spell family. Elf. I put an elm in the middle. Elf. See that little elf? I know it's hard to see it, you guys, but it's a little tiny elf. So, elf. I put the elm right there. And there's an I with dig. And then there's an L. See the L? And then there's a Y. So, ain't it funny how they're digging up, your fan is digging up stuff on your family. And it could be Aries watching me right now as we speak. Oh, and it could be, and it could be somebody in your house, Energy uh, Aries, if you're watching this, it's somebody doing it, though. So don't think I'm lying to you, because I know what I'm talking about. Oh, uh oh, 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 I know what it is. Oh, oh, wait till you all see. Let's see if this spells something. Somebody is trying to r r rob you. Oh, somebody's trying to rob me. It could be a Aries trying to rob me because, you know, this is my energy I'm pulling out. And anybody that's connected to my channel, are you listening? So the more subscribers I get, then I'll have new energy, you see? And they might be trying to r r rob R, a O, a B, and an S, robs. And this is about, you know, reciprocity domination by means of persuasion somebody's trying to persuade you into being generous equally with them because it says generosity versatility purification domesticity uh this is satisfactory definitions in the end i don't know but somebody's trying to rob from your ass i just told you and it's somebody maybe a fan in your family that's digging up stuff on you and they're trying to rob from you. I got an E and an E on. Remy, R E M Y. Remember your vision. I believe that's what it's saying. Y V. See this Y and see this V. I'm taking it as since it says this. This is about take a chance with this communion between equals. And because you're going to have an achievement, remember R E M. Or that group R E M. Maybe somebody likes listening to it all the time. But I believe it's saying remember your vision. Just I just got a Y and a V. I believe this is about your vision. And this is about. Um, as an element of prediction, it promises condition trump surprises, findings. They're discovering some of them as tardy and abandonment changes, domestic discord, absences. So, uh, read it like this. It says, it's somebody in your family is a vamp. They vamp you of your energy. They, they might, and you might be committed to this person. You might be married to them. And you're, maybe, maybe this is somebody you used to be married to since it says reconciliation. Or maybe you got a twin flame or a soulmate. But anyway, whoever it is, they might have went around lying and said you was a prostitute. And that was a dangerous, dangerous pleasure of them to do that. They shouldn't have did that. So you started, you took a stand and you start following your own energy. And, you know, so now... 
and it could be these tall whites that's coming up against you, these guarded beings. And, and what it says is, a fan of yours is digging up things in your family. A fan of yours is digging up things in your family. Uh, remember your vision. And they might be trying to rob from you, R-O-B-S. So I hope this helps somebody out there, Aries. And, or if you're uh, looking over here for an Aries, whatever you're looking here for, I hope that somebody got something from this. And if you did, please put a comment down below, and I love you. If it rings true and hit subscribe and like, and I love you, and I hope I can help people because that's all I'm getting from this. It says freedom is yours. Freedom is yours, and somebody's trying to rob this from you, your freedom. That's what it might mean. That's what they might be digging up and seeing. I don't know, but uh, you remember your vision. That's what it's saying. Remember your vision, and nobody's taking my vision. And if you're trying to rob and steal and take my content somewhere else, my spirit guides will come kill you. I know, because I done told you I got a passed over son, and I love him. He's been dead 10 years, and... Uh, he, he watches over his mama. Don't think he don't. He comes into my readings a lot. And my brother does too. And he told me some of my ops. And I love you, brother. And I thank you. And I know you're floating around. You and my son. And I love you. And I hope this helps somebody out there. And please like, subscribe, and share. Peace. And I hope to just give you a little bit of cheer today. Bye.